Hello, hello. Once upon a time, YouTube were kind enough to display video tags publicly on the watch page, but back in 2012, they decided to remove this feature and probably for the right reasons. However, if used responsibly, this can be very powerful and I do advocate trying to look at other people's tags and gaining inspiration from them. So how do we do this now that they're not public anymore? Well, I use a free tool called vidIQ and today I'm gonna to show you how to add and use that tool. Firstly, click the link in this card or the link in the description and you'll be taken to this page. You can sign up and use the Chrome extension for free. Uh, they do have some paid plans which unlock some extra features, but if all you want to do is unlock the tags, then the free plan is more than enough. So that's name, email, password twice, confirm you're human, read these terms, I've read these already. But obviously before you sign up to anything, you should be checking the terms. If you do agree, click here and then hit the sign up button. You will then be sent a confirmation link to that email you just registered with. Go to the email, click the link and you'll be sent here. So if you want to use more of the features, then you'd want to go through this authentication process just to see the tags. You don't need that. You just need the account. So what you can do now is in your URL bar, just type in chrome colon forward slash forward slash extensions. Then if you scroll to the bottom, get more extensions, and then you want to search the store for vidIQ, one word, and then there's one here, then click add to chrome, this is the one you want. It's gonna tell you what permissions the app needs. Make sure you're comfortable with anything that you're allowing permission to your browser and potentially your YouTube channel. I've used the tool for years and trust it, so I'm gonna click add extension and we'll see that's now installed. So once I go to YouTube, I'm gonna test it out on one of my favorite channels, H3H3. You'll see that as soon as the watch page loads, this new set of data comes up on the right-hand side of the video. This is the extension that we've installed going to work. The first time you use it, it may ask you to log in. Simply use the details that you've just set up when creating the account. And you'll see right here that those are the video tags that H3H3 H3 have added for this particular video. There's lots of other information here that's really useful. I'm not gonna go into it now, but I will go into it in future videos. So make sure you're subscribed by hitting that button here. You can click here to see my in-depth guide on tagging for YouTube. And finally, if you have a problem with this extension or you're using Firefox or Safari, click on this video here to see how you can use a tool called TubeBuddy to see these tags in exactly the same way.